group of truck drivers is in Indiana tonight as they head across the country to protest mask and vaccine mandates. The convoy was greeted off of I-70 today. Uh, the drivers plan to stay in Monrovia for two days. CBS4's Eric Graves talked with those truckers at their rally tonight. There was cars, RVs, trucks. Hundreds of vehicles came across I-70 today from St. Louis, all part of the People's Convoy. Our rights are, are being taken away. It's all happening at Ted Everett Farm Equipment right off State Road 39 in Monrovia. The convoy started in California and is making its way to D.C., picking up people along the way, like Sherry Tingey, a truck driver who joined in Missouri. It's people losing their jobs because they're not getting the shot. The convoy has made stops along the way, greeted by cheering supporters, just like Tuesday night. Support the truckers that are are sacrificing uh, their time and their gas and uh, to make our voices heard. Jeff and Dortha Hepworth drove in from Speedway to support the truckers. Deb Cowley came from Avon, all saying they want pandemic mandates repealed now. The mask, the vaccines, everything. As many mask mandates are being dropped across the country, Tingy says it's about federal vaccine mandates and the workers being fired because they refused the COVID-19 vaccine. And they want to separate us and, and some people keep their jobs and some people can't, just over a shot. As the convoy gets closer to Washington, D.C., Tingy says she hopes it sends a message to the current administration. This is open mic night. This is for the people. We hope that it says that that we are ready for them to go back to taking down the mandates. The convoy plans to be in central Indiana until Thursday morning before heading to its next stop. Reporting in Monrovia, Eric Graves, CBS4 News. The convoy is planning another rally tomorrow night in Monrovia. It will pass through Indianapolis on Thursday.